What's going on everybody? It's Lexi V03 and I am back with another video. If you guys don't know who I am, I am Lexi and you should definitely check out my channel right there. But in today's video, I'm going to do a what's in my backpack. If you guys didn't know, I'm doing a back to school series on my channel. So you should definitely go check that out. I have two other videos up right now so that you can go watch those. But let's get started with this video. So I don't know about you guys, but school starts for me in three days. So I have Monday, Tuesday, and I go by school on Wednesday. That is so tough. And I don't really want to go. But it's okay. Not really. Okay. We're going to go ahead and get started with these side pockets. And on the right side, I have my water bottle. And this is like a stainless steel water bottle. And it was weird. They put this on our list, but I wanted a water bottle anyway because... I hate getting up out of class just to go get water from the water fountain and then the water fountain water is like warm, <laughs> it's not even cold. So I have my water bottle and then on this side is where I keep my cell phone and my earphones. If you guys know me, I cannot go to school without earphones because I just don't know what I would do. I, I have a 45 minute bus ride so if I don't have earphones, that's just so boring. Okay guys, now we're gonna get into the big pot. Boom. Here we go. First, I have my wallet. And I always like to have my wallet on me because for my school, you have a lunch number and you put money into your account. And sometimes I accidentally forget to tell my mom to put money in it. So I have like two bucks if I ever forget because I do forget a lot. So I have my wallet just in case, you know, forget my lunch. So, we're gonna go ahead and get into all the boring stuff like school books. First, I have dividers. And they tell us to get dividers every single year. And I get them, and then we don't use them. But, just in case you know, a teacher wants me to have a certain binder with dividers in it, I always get it. So, dividers. Then I have two notebooks. I have a one subject notebook and a regular um, 70 page notebook. Yep. And if you guys couldn't tell, my theme, if you guys have watched my school supplies haul, my theme that I went for was black and white. So everything I have is black and white, including my Nike backpack. So yeah, you guys can go check out that video right here. Right here. Right here. Then I have my binders and I'm carrying two binders each semester. So this semester I have two binders and this one is driver's ed and geometry and inside of here I just have a black folder, some post-it notes, paper, and some graph paper, because this is geometry. So, yeah, this is my driver's in geometry. And then this is my black notebook, and I have physical science and introduction to robotics. And in here, I have pink sticky notes, a white notebook, paper, and more graph paper. So, yeah, those are my binders. Then I have a composition notebook, and this one is just black, and it has 70 pages in it, and I have several composition notebooks and several regular notebooks, but as the teachers tell me what I will need and what I won't need, you know, my backpack's gonna change, because this is just for the first day of school, so my backpack's probably gonna change a little bit when I start school, but yeah. Up next, I have my planner. This is my planner. It's black and white, rose gold. I mean black and rose gold polka dots and it just says pencil it in and you guys this planner is so cute and I really wanted to get a cute planner that's interactive because a lot of times I have regular planners and they're not very interesting and I don't use them but I am determined to use my planner this year you guys I will use my planner and I will not forget to turn in any assignments so I have my planner and then I have my essentials bag and it's just a black and white Sephora bag. Yeah. All right, let's go inside. Okay, so here's my essentials bag. It's a pretty nice size bag, which I was like, I like that because I wanted something a little bigger. But in here, I just have first, ooh, I have my glasses. And a lot of you guys probably didn't know that I actually wore glasses. But yeah, I do wear glasses um, for school because I sometimes get a headache while I'm reading. And I'm focusing really hard on something. So I have to get my glasses, which are dirty. <laughs> so yeah, just have my glasses. Oh, look. This is black and white too. Look at that. 
Oh wait, my bag's black and white. Uh -huh -huh. Yeah, I totally meant to do that. Okay. Then I have hair ties and headbands. So many times I go to school and I'm rushing to get on the bus and my hair looks a hot mess. That's where these come in. I have some scrunchies and I have this headband. Yep. And then I have bobby pins. This is such a big one for me. I use bobby pins for my buns, for this hairstyle. I use bobby pins a lot. So I always have to have this little thing, this little container of bobby pins. And then I have lotion. My bus comes at 6.50, you guys. 6.50 in the morning. So a lot of times I get on the bus, on the bus? <laughs> a lot of times I get on the bus and I'm like, Lord have mercy, I am ashy. <laughs> so it's a good thing that I have my lotion. And it's like a cute little size too. And then I have hand sanitizer. Because this is, this is like a must have. Because you're at school and it's like a really dirty environment, so hand sanitizer. Oh, Gabby actually got me this one for my birthday. Thanks, Gabby. Then I have my Victoria's Secret roll-on perfume and oh this smells so good. It is in the scent Heavenly and it smells heavenly. <laughs> but then I have my favorite lip gloss by Sephora. And it's this, it's kind of like a tint. It's kind of matches my nails too. Yeah, but it's a really cute lip gloss. And then what's left in this bag is my feminine products. You ladies know exactly what I'm talking about. So yeah, that's it. So yeah, that's what's in my essentials bag. Then there's this really cool pocket in front right here. I'm gonna just take everything out. Okay, I just have index cards. This is a very important study tool for me because I could just sit on the bus. The 45 minutes I have, I could just flip through my index cards, get a quick study session in. Yeah. Then I have, what is this? Oh, this is like a compass and protractor kind of set for school, well for math, because I do have math this semester, which is a bummer. But it's okay. So I have my little kit for geometry, which I'm not excited to use at all, but yeah. And last but not least, I have this bag. <laughs> it's like a little coin pouch and it has a bunch of coins in it. Like, I'm not even kidding. There are so much coins in here, you guys. Can you see that? Because we have vending machines at my school and sometimes I forget to eat breakfast or I don't have time and I'm like, vending machine. And then I'm like, I don't have vending machine money. So that's where this comes in. This is my St. Thomas coin pouch so that I'm never gonna be starving at school. Unless this runs out, because I'm fat. And now we're getting into the front pocket right here with the big Nike. I love that. It's my favorite part about this backpack is the huge Nike sign. I love that so much. So first I have my pencil pouch. This is one of two. I have two pencil pouches. This one is my main one. And this is a cosmetic pouch. So it's like for makeup and stuff. But it works perfectly fine as a pencil case. And it was like one of those deals where if you spend a certain amount of money, they send you something free. And yeah, this is super cute. But inside of here, I have my uh, mini stapler because I really don't like standing in line when our teachers, you know, pass the stapler around or something. I could just quickly pull out this, staple it. Then I have a stick of glue. I also have some scissors. I think these scissors were so cool. I don't know. I probably shouldn't play with scissors like that. But these cool scissors, I have these reinforcements. Oh my gosh. I didn't have reinforcements last year and I did in eighth grade. And man, I definitely made sure to pick some up this year because a lot of times I would have my binder, a paper would rip out and I would like fold the paper and put it in the, in the little pocket. And then when I went to look for it, it was, it was gone. <laughs> so I definitely made sure to get whole reinforcements just for when the paper breaks out of the binder. Then I have a, a hole puncher, pretty much for the same reason as a stapler. I won't have to stand in the lines. Plus if there's something I want to hole punch and it's not already hole punched, I can just whip this out and do it real quick. And then I have my calculator for math class. Uh, 
this pink eraser. And I have a bunch of pens and pencils, like the regular pens and the regular black and red pencils. Then I have my second pencil pouch, and I love this one. This one is so cute. It's black and white, but the colors inside just make it so cute. So in here, I have every single color of the rainbow. <laughs> I have a bunch of pens. These are so cute, and they're my favorite, and I just love them so much. I also have my uh, highlighters in here. But yeah, I just have a bunch of colorful pens because when you color code your notes and when you color code your planner, it's it's a good way to organize. It's a good way to, to, to stay organized. So yeah. And it also has these for like if you want to put it in a binder. But you see how thick this is? It's not going to fit in a binder. <laughs> but yeah, that's my uh, second pencil pouch. And then I have my house key. And my house key is just on this lanyard that says Nike on it. And it's blue. And it's super cute. And I have my house key because sometimes I get off the bus before everybody is home. And sometimes I forget my house key. And sometimes I have to call my dad and I'm like, hey, uh, I forgot my house key. And then he has to come all the way home and open the door for me. <laughs> so to make sure that I don't have to call my dad every five seconds every time I forget my house key, I'm keeping this in my backpack. Ooh, I probably will not keep this in my backpack. And I'm pretty sure I'll probably have to call my dad at least once this year, but I'm gonna try, okay? So that's my keys. Then you guys, I have gum and mints in my backpack because, well, for one, if I'm hungry and I run out of coins, I have something, something to chew. <laughs> and then for two, after lunch, I hate that feeling of once you're finished eating your lunch and you go back to class and you can just taste the lunch. <laughs> so I have some gum to chew after lunch. So yeah, and um, if you're watching this video and you go to my school, you can have some mints, not gum. Then I have my power bank. Guys, this is a great power bank. I've talked about this in my other What's In My Backpack video. Super strong power bank. But too many times I'm at school and my phone's at like 20%. And it's second block <laughs> so I have my power bank just to make sure you know my phone doesn't die and I have something to do for the rest of the day <laughs> so yeah to my power bank and then I have a combination lock it's purple and I'm not really sure why they made us get a combination lock I don't even have PE <laughs> but I just got it because they said to get it and this is actually one I already had so I just put it in my backpack just in case so if you guys notice I don't have any like locker supplies and locker decorations because lockers are optional at my school you don't have to get them last year i got a locker and i didn't use it at all i put some stuff in there to have and i probably went to the locker literally three times the whole school year and i never even cleaned it out <laughs> so everything i put in my locker is still in that locker <laughs> i never cleaned it out because i forgot because i didn't use it so <laughs> Um, I didn't get a locker this year just to make sure, you know, I don't want to pay for a locker and then, sorry mommy, you know, I don't want to pay for a locker and then, you know, not use it. So, I didn't get one this year. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, follow all my social media, hit the post notification bell because I do give post notification shout outs. All you have to do is hit the subscribe button, hit the post notification bell, and comment done when you're done. Because today's post notification shout out goes to Haley Nicole Fender and Rakaya Campbell. Thank you guys so much for hitting the post notification bell. I really appreciate it. And thank you guys for watching this video. Peace.